Margaret, Texas Gal Treasures, and welcome to my ride along video. I went around to some thrift stores the last few days and picked up a few things, not a ton of stuff, but I ended up spending a lot of money. So before we get into it, go down there and hit that subscribe button and hit the little bell next to it. I share my ride along just talking and things, and then I have a separate video where I share the haul and one of the jewelry jars that I picked up during this ride along. Um, but yeah, tune in for that because I have something I need some help with because I don't know exactly what it is. So I'd love some help if you get a chance to, to, to check it out. It's actually probably going to be out before this video. So yeah, go check it out and let me know what you think. Hey everybody, it is Margaret and I am out today doing a bit of thrifting. I don't know if you caught my, I guess it was right around New Year's where um, I talked about things are changing and I had intended on really just scaling back my business and just focusing on jewelry But as it turns out I have to do a little bit more to step up my game as far as paying bills So that's kind of been scratched So I am thrifting again and not doing so many de stash You just got to roll with it right things change also, I am in my car, but as you may have noticed I'm not rolling um, because I'm really challenging myself to not do vlogs where I am driving anymore because I just know how dangerous it is and and it was just something that I did in the past and now I'm like oh, I think that's something that maybe needs to stop so I guess if you want to call it a resolution but it's more of a let's be smart about things and not drive and talk at the same time because it's not worth it if I got into a car accident and hurt somebody because I was trying to make a video. So I am parked talking. So I'm heading, I just went to the Goodwill. I actually came yesterday with the guys after we went to the gym. And so I'm gonna head over to Salvation Army. This is like the corner where there's like a Goodwill, Salvation Army, a couple of, th of other um, thrift stores. So I'm gonna hit those and then I'm gonna go check out some that are in a different area that I don't go to all the time. Cause I feel like I go to the same ones all the time and just, I want to branch out today. Um, it's my last day before kids, you know, we start back with homeschool tomorrow. We're going to do some later today just to kind of slowly get back into the groove. My car's getting close. Um, so yeah, I'm going to head over there and see what I find. Uh, so far I got nothing, but I'll, I'll see what, what I see. So here we go. Okay, so I went into, what is it called? Hidden Angels, which is a consignment store. Not a consignment store, but a, it's a charity shop, resale shop. They have a coffee shop. It's a little different. <laughs> One time I went to buy something that was put out, and they have like these displays, but they wouldn't let me buy it because they had just put it on display, which was weird. They were like, well, we can take your name down and we'll call you when it, it comes off display. Like, why do you have a charity shop but you're not selling your stuff anyway <laughs> so I don't go in there a ton some of their stuff's pricey sometimes you find deals and I had an open mind I was willing to buy anything that I thought would make a good profit and I walked out with jewelry <laughs> so I had a little bag of jewelry I think I spent $11 on mostly earrings um, they had a big basket I'll insert a pic because she was dumping the whole basket out because pieces had fallen off and she was trying to rematch up. So of course that's like my hog heaven, like digging through jewelry. So yeah, I, <laughs> I sat there and was like, ooh, going through all the jewelry with her. Woo. Okay, now I'm gonna head over to Salvation Army. I'm still on thrift store row. And then I'm gonna head out of this area because this is my normal area. I was The whole plan was to go somewhere new. So I didn't find anything for sale, for to sell rather, I lost all of the things for sale, but for to sell for me, but I did find something for me. It was this film artifact box and it is a Hermione Granger. That's not the right price. There's a white one down here. He charged me the $2.99 price for the Hermione Granger. The box is cool by itself, right? But it's got stuff. It's missing some of the items, but it's got some stuff. It's got a Yule Ball poster. In case you are wanting to go to the Yule Ball, there's a Yule Ball poster. There is a map, maybe, if I can open it, of her, I don't know, is this her schedule, maybe? I don't know. This is, I'll have to look at it later. And this is another doodad. I don't even know what it is. Like, for her to keep her schedule on? I don't know. What is this? How to fill in this exam paper. Oh, it's an exam paper. Well, geez, Hermione, you didn't do your work. So anyway, <laughs> there's that. Uh, I just like the box, right? And here's the inside. It's like 
the uh, Marauders map on the inside. It's really cool. So mostly for the box because it's awesome. Cool. Harry Potter. Rock on. Okay. <laughs> Moving on now. I'm going now. I'm leaving because this was Salvation Army, and now I'm gonna go to another area to find hopefully other things. I almost bought a pitcher. Pitcher. It was like a green, like arts and crafts type pottery pitcher. Um, it's Car Carmack is the name of the maker, um, and it was cool and everything. But this, they wanted five bucks for it, and then the solds, solds were anywhere from like, or from what I was seeing, I didn't actually see sold solds, but I saw some for sale. I saw some on Pinterest, so it was anywhere from like fifteen to twenty five bucks. And I was like, it's really cool, but I don't want to spend five bucks. If it's only going to bring 15 at this moment. Because I have so much stuff at home, right? It needs to be bigger. Bigger! Okay. I'm out. Okay, so I did find a couple things at this Goodwill, which is one I don't come to all the time. I got a another towel. Pull, I would pull it out, but it's all wrapped up. But I'll show it later. It's like a toast rack. But then it's got two con little condiment, like for marmalade and butter on this side. And so it's silver plate with little crystal dishes. Um, I picked it up. It was on sale 30% off today. Yay! So it was like $6.99. I can't find one exactly like it. I see some that have been up but sold on Etsy and I don't, I can't access it from my phone. So I'll have to do it when I get home. I got some construction paper, which is super exciting for homeschool stuff because when I find supplies out for cheaps, I get some. And then I picked up a loot pin. If you are into loot crates, you know there's loot pins. Some are worth money, some aren't. And so I was like, well, you know, it's 99 cents. I'll just take a chance on it. So I got that too. So I will let you know how that goes. And I don't know, I'm going to go maybe hit one or two more thrift stores. And then I might do a haul video later. I haven't done like a haul video in a while. Okay, see ya. All right, I went to this next Goodwill. Somebody's getting in their car with and I picked up six jewelry jars. Five of them were 20 bucks, one of them was 30 bucks, but they all looked really good. So I'm excited about that. They'll go on my jewelry jar hoard shelf, which is actually getting smaller, so that's okay. And then I also picked up a couple loose pieces of jewelry and some construction paper, notebook paper that they had for like 79 cents or something for homeschool stuff just always on the lookout for things that we might need for the cheaps. I need to really stock up this year on school supplies after after kids go back to school and they put all the back to school stuff on sale. But you know you live and learn. Oh I'm driving. Don't drive. Okay. Um, <laughs> I gotta break that habit. Alright so I'm heading home now because I think I've spent 200 bucks. I spent 150 right now with jewelry jars and loose pieces of jewelry and then ten dollars here ten dollars there eleven dollars you know whatever at the other stores probably hitting close to 200 bucks i'm good need to go home now and decide if i want to do a haul video i don't have a huge amount for a haul or a jewelry jar video let's find out <laughs> Thanks so much for watching you guys. Again, go down there and hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it so you're notified when new videos come out by me and I will talk to you later. Bye.